Hey y'all, I'm Justina, the Gorgeous Oracle, and I'm back with a random read. It's been a while since I got on camera with my makeup on. And I'm like, you know what, I'm about to get cute. It's been a while since I did my makeup. I be lazy, I don't be feeling like doing that shit. But, um, yeah, so let's see what Spirit got for us, got for y'all. I usually do this off camera because I, I don't be wanting y'all to wait. But, whatever. So, I'm Justina, the Gorgeous Oracle, back with another reading. Um, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Feel free to follow me on Instagram at I am underscore Justina Nicole. Everything will be down in the description box below this video. Y'all, don't forget to like my videos, share my videos, subscribe to my channel. That means a lot to me, okay? So, let's jump into the reading. Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? I wanted a card or some cards to jump out, but they not jumping out tonight. Let me pull out my, for extra messages, this is the Island New Time Wellness Love Oracle Deck. Spirit, what um additional messages do you have for the collective for this random read? I'm hearing regret. I just heard sorrow. Spirit, what messages, what additional messages do you have for this random read? Mm -mm. Whoever this person I'm picking up, um, they having a hard time focusing. It's like this person is trying to do multiple things at once, but it's not panning out for them. It's like they're trying to keep themselves occupied because of what transpired between y'all. So y'all, for the collective, what I got for y'all, I have the Knight of Swords in reverse. I have the Seven of Swords. I have the Ace of Swords. This is a lot of mental. I just heard Cerebral. I have the Temperance. And I have the Eight of Pentacles in reverse. So I have the, the Knight of Swords in reverse, Seven of Swords, Ace of Swords reverse, Temperance, and the Eight of Pentacles reverse. For the additional messages, I have Karmic Relationship. I just heard Mistaking. I feel like this person made a mistake. I have Hammer. I have Talking. I just heard this, pers this person has a fear that you may not talk to them. I have Cupid's Arrow. Then last but not least, I have the sword and the rose. Yes, a lot of swords out here. Um, 
so yeah, a lot of swords. That's Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. You could be dealing with an air sign. Um, Earth. <laughs> um, I mean, however it resonates with your situation. I feel like this person... Um, I'm feeling like this is past energy, but I feel like one of the reasons why this person has not came forward to you or have not made a move towards you, because this person, um, they did some shady ass shit behind your back. This person could have been spreading lies, uh, just painting you out to be a monster to people. She did this. She did that. She did this to me. She said this to me. And the whole time, it was just a whole bunch of lies. I just heard cover-up. I feel like you was the fall guy. I feel like the things this person said you did, really and truly, this person did that to you. <laughs> but they saying that you did it. They saying that you lying on them. Um, just making up shit on them. You betrayed them. You backstabbed them. But really, it's the other way around. I just heard narcissist. This person could be a narcissist or has some type of narcissistic traits. Um, I just heard mental imprisonment. I feel like this person is in um, like a spiritual jail. Is something going on with them spiritually? Uh... They get in their karma for what they did to you, but it's on like a 5D type of level. Like, say, for instance, if you have loved ones that passed on, or it could be your ancestors, God, whoever's been watching over you and just protecting you. I feel like, yo, I feel like whoever's on the three, not three D, on the 5D protecting you, they actually getting this person back for you. Or this person is like receiving their karma. This person could have um, mental issues. This person could be bipolar. This person could be, um, they could suffer from paranoia. This person is crazy. But I feel that one of the reasons why they lied on you, smeared your name, is because they have mental issues. Yeah, this person, they have some type of mental disorder. Like, like I said, it could be bipolar. Hell, I just heard schizophrenia. I feel like towards people to the outside world, they portray like everything is good with them. They portray like, I just heard stalker. They portray like you're the stalker. They just be chilling. They don't understand why you can't leave them alone. But really, it's the other way around. This person... Was strategically planning. I just heard deceiving, conniving, misleading people, like turning people against you. And I feel like through all of the bullshit, through all the drama that they did behind your back or even in front of your face, you still like focusing on yourself you worrying about balance harmony peace love in your life and this person is worrying about revenge being hateful conniving mischievous devious devil i mean i don't have the devil card out here but it's like y'all the opposites you on some peace love harmony black power whatever but this person Represents like the opposite of what you represent. That's one of the reasons why you don't fuck with this person. 
you and this person, I feel like y'all never been on the same page. If y'all were on the same page, it was the very beginning stage when y'all first met. You know, when you met the representative. So that's probably when y'all was on the same page. But other than that, you and this person has never been on the same page. And then another message I got, this person is confused. And conflicted like damn i didn't said this i didn't did that i betrayed the collective i betrayed i lied i said all types of things but this person is still full of love peace and harmony i just heard laughter you could be laughing a lot smiling a lot or if you like say if you on instagram and facebook lately you've been uploading pictures of you smiling and laughing and stuff and this person sees that and they like astonished like what how the fuck she or he's laughing and cheesing and i just said so much shit behind the scenes about this person and every time they upload a picture they laughing and smiling like they just having a good old time in their life this person don't understand how you do it Another message I'm getting, this person, um, after they try to destroy you or ruin your reputation, this person could have been trying to be on some cool by y'all, you know, uh, let me be spiritual, let me meditate, let me get in tune with nature. After they did fuckery and foolishness, the, the second message I got is now they want to be love peace and harmony after they was full of destruction and <laughs> just full of games manipulative it's like now they the nerve of this person it's like now they want to be peace love and harmony but yet karma doesn't miss nobody as a result of their actions the outcome is the eight of pentacles in reverse this person they working on something but whatever they're working on it's not panning out for them it's not working out for them they're not bearing no fruit they're not making no money they actually losing money i feel like when this person is alone they think about like their next move on how they're gonna make some money become successful oh i'm gonna have different sources of income i'm gonna do this i'm gonna do that i'm gonna start this but as a the outcome all the shit they thought about doing is it's not working out for them I just heard going through it. This person is really going through it. So it's on, on top of them having mental issues and they not trying to resolve their personal issues. But yet their career life, the however they make their money, that's a disaster because they not making no money. They mental them having some type of mental disorder. That's a disaster too. But this person is still trying to Hmm. Hmm. But it's like, how the fuck you gonna try to <laughs> meditate and be peaceful and connect with the universe when you're not even connecting to yourself and acknowledging that you have mental issues and you need to seek help for that? This person is crazy. So for the additional messages, I have karmic relationship, bleeding, triggers, turmoil, resentment lessons letting go and loving you i feel like this person they not getting it or it's like they not understanding <laughs> like you supposed to learn from your mistakes and grow this person not learned from their mistakes And another message I'm getting, I feel like your person treated you like you was the karmic or you was a karmic relationship. Um, it's a meme. The I forgot the meme exactly, but it says some shit like imagine fucking over the person God sent to heal you. 
It says something like that. This person, I feel like you was placed in this person's path to help them and to heal them or so they can have some type of deep reflection on themselves. But it's like they just missed the whole point. It was like while they were so focused on trying to tear you down and smear your name in the mud, this person had a whole bunch of shit they needed to work on themselves. This person, cuckoo, cuckoo. So I have hammer, sabotage, rebuilding, integration, repetitive, working on it. So with the sabotage, I feel like that the person tried to sabotage your name. Smear campaign. Repetitive. I feel like this is something this person does with everybody they talk to. Like, say for instance, every time when they in a relationship with somebody and they are getting ready to break up, your person run and tell everybody, yeah, this person did this, this person did that. Fuck that person. That person cheated on me. That person lied on me. And the whole time, your person is the one that actually did the shit. So I feel like they do this with everyone they date. Like, they not new to acting like this at all. It's just that with you, Collective... How they haven't, I just heard a mental breakdown. I feel like this person had a mental breakdown. What makes you so different because it's like they play this game and they do this to everybody. And usually the people are affected by the smear campaigns, the lying, the cheating. That Their victims usually lose their damn mind. But I feel like with you, you just... Shrug that shit off your shoulders, dust that shit off your shoulders, and kept it moving. And this person, it fucked this person up because they not used to a person just being so strong and just moving forward in their life. They not used to that. They used to motherfuckers like, why you do me like this? I can't believe you. But you, it's like, okay, nigga, okay, bitch, you want to act stupid? deuces and they they can't believe like hmm she's not supposed to act like this he's not supposed to act like this so with the working on it what i got from this car was this person could be plotting on what else can i do to break you down it's like this person keep fucking with you but yet, to the outside world, they make me seem like you keep fucking with them. But behind the scenes, and even by you watching this video for confirmation, you the one that's getting bullied. This could have been past tense. Because this person's losing out on money. Yeah, I feel like this is past tense. Past tense, this person was bullying you and shit. But it's like now... They trying to focus on themselves and they trying to meditate and have a connection with God. But yet, they, I feel like they going about it the wrong way. But anyways, I have talking, interested, conversing more, awaited messages, text call, email, hoovering. I feel like this person wants to talk. They want to see what you've been up to. I just heard they want to know why are you so happy. They don't understand why you so happy. And they did so much stuff to you, but they just they just trying to figure out why the fuck are you this person so happy. They want to really talk to you to see what's going on to be nosy and to wonder if you're talking or dating somebody else or yeah, that's what they want to know. It's like Cupid's arrow, have faith, love is coming, surprise, invitation, meeting, hesitation. I feel, reading this, I picked up your person feel like the reason why you're so happy because 
your person feel like that you feel that you know love is coming whether if it's from them or from somebody else it's like you open to meeting new people or dating new people and this person is worried because it's like damn you finally moved on or you finally moving on i can't believe it the sword and the rose clarity truth revelation force honor protection power i feel like the clarity and the truth is that it's something wrong with your person And this person like to play power games. But yeah, I feel like the clarity and the truth. And by y'all watching this reading, this is something wrong with this person. And don't nobody know this. But um, yeah, that's all I got for this reading. For this random read. Until we meet again, and don't forget to like, share, subscribe to my channel. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Thank you. Bye-bye.